Hi, it's Leslie, and we're checking in on the Davis family. And yep, their dates went so well that Jasmine is coming over for the weekend for sleepover. Yay! And here's Nick just, you know, putting out there again his family structure, this crock of shit that he, uh, you know, adheres to. The reason we structure our relationship like this is to ensure that there isn't anyone feeling entitled to a greater share of anything in regards to our relationship. Yeah, that's a load. Uh, it, it's, it's, it's not claim. It's called legal claim. And it's called, uh, yeah, he doesn't have any legal dealings with any of this mess. That's what that means. Oh, but they're so excited about Jasmine. We want Danielle to be able to have that other wife to be able to marry too, to really balance out the family. Yeah, you know what I feel about that. That's just a load of crap. But anyway, look at Danielle's face. I mean, she looks sick. She looks sick. Anyway, they bring him over and, they, you know, they open up the bottle of wine and Jasmine is not drinking alcohol. I'm like, oh, no, you, you need a drink, honey. You need to at least have a drink. But she went non-alcoholic. Uh, if she had asked me, I would have said, oh, bad move, bad move. But everyone else was partaking in a little drink. But let's just check in again with Danielle. Well, let's go in. Yep, she still looks sick. Anyway, they of course have a quick discussion about how they're gonna sleep that night and we got to see a very good visual of this bed. You know that I'm obsessed with this bed and it is freaking big. And the first thing I thought is like, oh my God, you gotta have all your dogs up there and they would all have their spots and everything. I am obviously not set up for this stuff, but that is a big freaking bed because it, it was huge. It was huge. Oh my. Yes, so huge come bed. in. We will be sleeping wow. here. In Jasmine's game. I think sleeping in the bed would be fine. Alrighty then. Oh, that's gonna be exciting. I'm gonna have a lot of get a lot of cuddles here. You know, all kind of snuggles. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> And then they asked the question about like rules. Of course, everything I'm wanting to know, like, cause a lot of them have like rules of what you're allowed to do before they're like committed, whatever that means. And um, Nick um, was quick to say, yeah, there's no friggin' rules. It's basically whatever I feel like doing, I do. Because obviously it's his rules, you know? And, but they didn't seem to consult Jasmine and she had some different rules. So Nick, slow your roll a little. But I guess they decided to keep sex off the table for now. Um, I don't think they ran this by Jasmine because you'd think you would consult her on this, but you know what? It's not on the table right now, so there you go. But just in case you were wondering about his feelings about what's okay to do and not to do. Rules. <laughs> yeah, the rules are there are no rules. Do as thou wilt is the whole of the law. So you do it how we want to do it. <laughs> so gross he's just so gross oh, anyway anyway this lovely evening commences in the hot tub they all put on their little swimsuits and hop in the hot tub and I had some feelings on this I'm thinking the girl with the super long hair I'm gonna call her Jennifer I'm not really sure I, I think that's Jennifer she's not into Nick not into Nick he, he slapped her on the butt and she was not moved she's not into him the more the merrier she wants a million wives because you know what that's less I have to sleep with them you know but anyway um Jasmine came in there and wanted, they wanted to, like, why wouldn't you want to talk and get to know each other? Isn't that, like, normal? Am I just such an old fart that that doesn't seem like, even in this crazy situation, that wouldn't be what you would want to do is, like, get to know the person? So I thought that was a good thing of answering questions. But then she went off on, like, what's your favorite color and talking about blue and all its form. And I was like, oh, good God, these people. And she wasn't even drinking. But anyway, they thought that was really bizarre because I guess, I, what were they expecting to happen? Like, Really? Like, was something going to happen in the hot tub? No, nothing's going to happen in the hot tub. Like, I don't even, this is so crazy. But they thought she was weird because she wanted to talk and just answer stupid questions. I'm th thinking she was like, yeah, let's let's talk. Because the more we're talking, the less I have to deal with all this other, God forbid someone tries to do something. And Anyway, but anyway, I follow this nonsense every week. So if you want to follow along, please subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I will see you next week. Bye.